Hello students, today we are going to see session 2 on English usage which is about fillers. What is fillers? In this you will have certain sentences and there will be a blank space. Let us go to the questions. Question number 1. If the federal government does not dash a certain part of the law, then the state is responsible for self-governance. You are being given five options out of which you have to identify the right option. First option, regulate. Second option, enhancing. Third option, controlled. Fourth option, regulation. And fifth option, managing. So, what does the statement trying to convey? If the federal government does not dash a certain part of the law, then the state is responsible for self-governance. So, it means that if the government is not trying to initiate a particular action, then the state will be responsible for self-governance. So, what is that that matches with the initiative or the action plan? So, from the given option, option 1 regulate seems to match with the given space and if you take the other options like enhancing or controlled or regulation or managing does not have any proper meaning if it is fit into that blank space. So, what is regulate here? Regulate is nothing but control or maintain the rate or speed of a machine or process so that it operates properly. Now, let us move to the next question. According to the company budget, we must dash 12 percent of our financial resources to marketing. You have five options. Option number one, allocation. Option two, separation. Option three, renders. Option four, allocate. And option five, includes. So, what does the statement trying to convey? According to the company budget, we must dash 12 percent of our financial resources to marketing. So, that means the company is expected to set aside some amount which has to be born for a particular purpose or used for a particular purpose. So, the amount that is set aside, what is that to be matching? So, if you take option A, allocation, somewhat is matching with the space, then you have separation, it seems it is not matching into that blank space and if you see renders even that and next one allocate, allocate is also matching and the next one includes. So, from the given options, option number 1 and option number 4 has some relevance to the given space, but which will be more appropriate when we try to match the blank space. Here, let us try to get the meaning of allocation. Allocation is something which is already being done. It is more like allocated. Allocation being done or allocation under process. But here, must means something is expected. So, obviously, allocation cannot fill into the blank space. So, let us take the option number 4 which is allocate. So, we must allocate is trying to convey the appropriate meaning. So, we have to choose option 4 allocate. Now, let us move to the next question that is question number 3. When you dash someone's secret after they have confided in you, they will most likely never trust you again. So, what is the statement trying to convey? When you dash someone's secret, that means when you are trying to expose or when you are trying to say a secret which is conveyed by other person to you, so they will never trust you or they won't trust you. So, from the given options like presentation, reveal, 
iteration revealing and disclosed the most suitable word or appropriate word which can fill into the spaces option number two that is reveal so what is the meaning of reveal make known to others okay the information which is unknown to others you are trying to make it visible or make it clear okay let us move to the next question as a punishment my teacher required me to stand in front of her desk and dash 100 times that i would not shoot spit balls during class so that means here you have five options like recitation pronunciation talked representing and recite so what is the statement trying to convey as a punishment my teacher required me to stand in front of a desk and 100 times means something is expected because of an action so it can be a punishment or it can be a penalty or a fine so here we need to understand that it is a punishment so obviously something the teacher is expecting to do so from the given option which will be more appropriate is it option one recitation or option five recite so recitation is something which is already done or which is under process recite is something which is expected to be done and the most appropriate option here will be option five recite now let us move to the next question question number five we wanted to dash the garage into an extension of the living room so you have five options that is option number one renovation option two developing option three modifies option four refurbish and option five developed so from the given options which one will be fitting into that space so what is expected we wanted to dash the garage into an extension of the living room that means we are trying to enlarge or increase or expand okay so what word will exactly fit into that space is it renovation or developing or modifying or refurbish or developed so the most appropriate word from the given options will be refurbish so what is the meaning refurbish means renovate any existing item or redecorate something which may be a building or a proper structure let us move to the next question question number six after i stay home with my new baby for a year i will dash my role as a full-time educator so what is that statement trying to convey after i stay home with my new baby for a year i will dash my role as a full-time educator that means you are already into your role and because of a particular break or particular gap now you are unable to do something but you want to continue again so that is what it is trying to convey so from the given options which will match you match that one is it renewed or reprise or reiteration or disturb or relation so here you want to do the same thing which you were doing earlier that means it is a repeat so which word conveys the word repeat here is it renewed or reprise or reiteration or disturb or relation so let us take the first word renewed renewed is one thing which is extended okay so that may not match with the blank space here next one reprise reprise is repeat so whatever things that you were doing earlier you want to do it again so it is repeat reiteration means you are trying to recode it's also similar to repeat but it is not conveying the meaning what is expected in this space and disturb is something which you are trying to be a hindrance or a troublesome one and the next one relation is trying to correlate okay so the most appropriate word which can fill into the space is option two that is a price 